peace family so i'm back with another one you know what i'm saying so today what i wanted to do is i wanted to dive a little bit in on a, a spiritual different perspective of being the black sheep so i know it's a lot of content out about being the black sheep and it's a lot of different perspectives um but for me and my understanding of being the black sheep of my family, you know what I'm saying? My mom had four kids, older sister, she was the invisible child. I was next, I was the black sheep. I got a brother a year younger than me. He was the golden child. And then my youngest brother was just four years younger than me. He was the dependent, you know what I'm saying? I relied on my mom for everything. But um, I see some content being posted about the black sheep and, and as far as like standing out in your family, being different, having different views on life, you know what I'm saying? Like just being different overall than the crowd of your family. Um, but, uh, but some of the content and some of the information gets a little tricky. Um, and just because I feel like the black sheep doesn't have anything to do with your gender. You know what I'm saying? Your sexuality. People keep making it interchangeable, but I, I'm a spiritual being. Your sex is your gender. It's the same fucking thing. I don't live in that confusing space. Anybody or any entity trying to confuse me, I'm going to put the ass all in this box with that witchy shit. You know what I'm saying? So, I, I see... And uh, outside of what I see, it's like my understanding of the black sheep and being a black sheep, like I had to wear the brute of a lot of things that happened in my household, you know what I'm saying? Whether it was due to the cause of my brothers doing some shit, you know what I'm saying? Or whether it was my mom just being in a fuck ass space, you know what I'm saying? And just wanted to drop all her bullshit on me, you know what I'm saying? Or it, it, you know, they kind of push insecurities off onto you, you know what I'm saying? You, you kind of like the dumpster of the family, you know what I'm saying? But what I wanted to get at today with the differentiation was that being a black sheep is more so about being a chosen one, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and being highly empathetic you know what i'm saying having certain abilities when you was born having a lot of insight foresight you know what i'm saying like it has to do with a lot of things in the spirit realm but i see a lot of shit talking about the black sheep and it's just people who just chose to be fucking weird and witchy if you the black sheep of your family because you decided to be fucking around with the same sex that's not a black sheep I, I, we have to start distinguishing things if it's a war going on out here then we need to know who's on what team you know what I'm saying it's not confusing so anything that seems a little bit confusing then we have to start bringing more clarity to it so for me I, I when I hear things like that or watch things like that it, it makes me like understand the system that's in charge and the demonic entities that's basically running everything you know what i'm saying like the, anytime information gets put out they put it their own little flip on it to make it seem like it could go both ways now it could go both ways but fucking around if you with the creator you know what i'm saying it's only gonna go this way but the other people leave you confused in this space and it could go down here it could go over there it could go over there, there 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 it's not how the creator works you know what i'm saying the universe that's not how this shit operates out here but I, I see a lot of shit about the shit being a black sheep and you know what I'm saying, the scapegoat. It, it don't have nothing to do with your sexual orientation or your gender, you know what I'm saying? And for the ones that's making it seem like they are because they sexual orientation, they with the ops. That ain't got nothing to do with it because that's not regular behavior from a human being or a being having a human experience. You know what I'm saying? So understand that if somebody is speaking of black sheep or scapegoat in these manners they're not the black sheep or the scapegoat 
they're probably a vessel being used by the ops to put this information out here. A black sheep is going to be somebody with, you know, more spiritual abilities within them. You know what I'm saying? Shit that they just had within them since birth that they didn't even know they had. You know what I'm saying? You got adults around you and older people around you, teenagers or fucking, you know, people in their 20s when you young that's around you and they see the light in you. They know what's up with you, but you don't even know what's up with yourself. That don't have nothing to do with your sexual orientation. You know what I'm saying? So being able to be mindful and be aware of everybody wants to put out information. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's right, not right, organic, not organic. Everybody is, that's just the day and age we're in right now. You know what I'm saying? Where everybody wants to relay information because we have access to so much information. So you got beings who's putting out organic information their vessel for the, from the creator you know what i'm saying their vessel is being used by the creator just like how the, the ops is using the other vessels you know what i'm saying so it's just constantly being aware and being mindful and paying attention to the keywords being used you know what i'm saying we're not always able to interact with everybody on a physical plane you know what i'm saying in the way it's set up right now the technology isn't bad it's the entities in charge and the beings using it you know what i'm saying that's like saying the gun is bad the gun isn't bad it's the motherfucker with the gun it's like dog owners the dog isn't bad it's the motherfucker that's taking care of the motherfucker so once we start distinguishing this wordplay with these confusing beings you know what i'm saying like we should not be in a confusion state you know what i'm saying it's okay to not have answers for something because something is unknown that's completely different you know what i'm saying but to be dealing with other beings and then feeling confused after dealing with them or being with them that shouldn't be part of the picture you know what i'm saying and if you 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 learning and building from somebody or with somebody and they're bringing you information then it shouldn't be based around their sexual orientation because then that kind of confuses the the beings who just genuinely want the information you know what i'm saying so scapegoating and black sheep you know what i'm saying that shit ain't got nothing to do with your sexual orientation you know what i'm saying and for the ones that think that it do that's because you riding with the ops and you're not a black sheep from the creator you're a white sheep in with the ops you know what i'm saying or you're a white sheep in with us like you, you clearly are over on this side black sheep has scapegoats have nothing to do with those things you know what i'm saying and once we start understanding that, then we can start scratching that off to the side when we hear that information or be around beings who wants to put that agenda first. And we can focus more on the information and, and just being able to be able to place that being in that information in a certain space to where you don't have to put too much weight or too much emphasis on it. You know what I'm saying? So it's basically just staying in tune and tapping in, you know what I'm saying? And just constantly being aware of the wordplay you know what i'm saying it's a lot of agendas being pushed out here but the main one we want to follow is the one with the creator raising this motherfucking frequency you know what i'm saying i ain't want to make this too long i just wanted to drop that up there for y'all you know what i'm saying y'all tap in i always got the merch on the banners down below this is get busy you know what i'm saying everybody that throw me free merch you know what i'm saying i usually they got lifetime promo over this way you know what i'm saying i had some jewelry made up they all um, down there on the banners too you know what I'm saying? Everything is always down below, but I do support outside of here too. You know what I'm saying? That's what I constantly do full time. But y'all tap in, you know what I'm saying? Peace of the kings and queens.